at the Idaho State House, a stunning display for National Agriculture Day. A table set for 165 people. That's the number of people an Idaho farmer can feed in just a year. And if you had to consume everything produced in the state and we didn't export anything, we would have a tremendous amount of food to eat every single day, including 43 potatoes every day, several loaves of bread, two pounds of cheese, and a whole lot more. Simply put, Idaho farmers are the best in the world, yet few people know how good or how much farmers produce and the economic impact of what they do. National Ag Day is set aside to help educate the world. Idaho Governor Brad Little looked thoughtfully at the 165 place settings. That We do pretty well in Idaho, but we're going to have to continue to innovate and add value to those commodities because it's such a big driver in Idaho. We look at the banks here in town and the insurance companies. You know, those banks and insurance companies, they bank and insure a lot of farmers and food processors. Uh, you know, the fertilizer industry in Idaho is heavily dependent upon not only farmers in Idaho, but other states. So you add it all up, it's critical mass. And Representative Tom Daly says it's critical that we all realize agriculture's essential role in maintaining a strong economy. And that's why this is a, a very good thing here in the city, here that we need to educate uh, Idahoans about the importance of agriculture to them personally. Each one of uh, each Idahoan, it's very uh, individually important to them, not only because they eat, but because of what it is to the Idaho economy. And bottom line. But they're also the economic engine of Idaho. 20% of all sales in the state come from agriculture. So it's the engine of our economy, part of our culture, our heritage, and it puts the food on the table for all of us. Idaho ranks among the most productive in the nation for dairy, potatoes, wheat, sugar beets, hay, and many more crops. Idaho Ag, this is your day. For the Voice of Idaho Agriculture, I'm Jake Putnam.